Hi guys, Marcus here. Today you see we have an Apple Watch Series 5 and it is completely shattered as you can see. We will try to fix it for just around 20 bucks. What? It's more an experiment, I haven't tried it before. But if this will work, that is a brilliant way to fix your shattered watch. So the idea is basically you get these yeah, 3D curved glass protectors and they will work with UV. So basically you have everything you need to get this onto our watch. This here is the UV light we will use to cure it. So the idea is hopefully when we apply our UV glue on this here that it will go in every little cavity that's found and shattered pieces that in the end I think we will see that it was damaged but I hope it's still usable. I mean here you can see it is working fine well, so it's working but yeah it's really it's not looking good and if you try to use it you will yeah maybe just injure yourself with these sharp edges or something so that's something we will try so let's get started in this package we do get three of these glass protectors so if we shadow one or it will not work we have two more in spares so that's something we need in the future this here is the glass itself. We will need it also in a bit. And here we see the glue. That's UV glue. And we will try to apply it and yeah, see if it will work. First remove the straps here. And please make sure not to do a lot of pressure here. Otherwise you maybe shatter it even more. So let's have a short look in the user manual. Here's also a video for the installation from the manufacturer. And basically you have this mount here where we just clip in our watch. We need this here as the ceiling. So we do need some water and bring it out later on. Then this here goes on this here. And we need to remove the dust. There's also in the package some of these, just some dust removal stickers and stuff. And yeah, that's the moment where we can apply the glue and try to apply the glass and just try to let it fall down with the help of this little thing here. So let's try this out, I would say. So let's shut it down. Now we need to make sure that we put it from the bottle side in this thing here. Oops, maybe it's a good idea to lay it down, like so. It's with a shattered watch, of course, yeah, a little bit more tricky. So, and remember, this here is the normal s screensaver. So this here is just an experiment. I have no idea if it works. Now, we do need some water. I just have here some distilled water. You can use normal tap water. It's, doesn't matter. Just have this laying around here. And let's use this here. And we'll let it soak. The direction says 30 seconds. Because this here will prevent the glue from getting to areas where we don't want the glue to be. Already enough. Now we just wring it out. And now we put this here, all these plastic stands. Like so. Now we open one of these things here. So what do we get? We got a little, yeah, wipe and a wet wipe and some stickers to remove dust. Um, yeah, let's use the wet wipe. I mean, it's a little bit hard because it's a shattered watch. <laughs> so I hopefully won't get some of the, yeah, 
parts of this wipe into some of these shatters. Hopefully, if so, we can remove it with the sticker. We will find hopefully out. So, and like any screen protector, try to avoid any dusty area, of course. Okay, now let's use the dust absorber here. It's basically just a sticker. And try to remove anything. ruin our new screen so it's very hard to judge with with a shattered screen but we will see so turn this back on now to the fun part we have three glasses so we have three tubes of UV glue let's use the first one and we can move this here now grip all the all the glue. I think that's a lot, but okay, let's try it. So all the glue is now in the middle of the screen. You see the blob. And you see this little yeah, angled thing. This will help us to slowly drop down our glass. So here we do have our glass. Let's remove the film. Of course, don't touch it from the inside. And now we just lay it, put it down here, lay it down here, and it will fall on this thing here. And now we just slowly try let it fall down. And you see the glue spreads. Let's use the provided UV lamp. Open the legs here and just place it over here. And now we will wait 150 seconds. And by the way, this was inside the package, so do not return it. It will just waste the environment. They just kindly ask you to tell you that you have some problems with it and you get a free replacement or full refund. Okay, 150 seconds over. Now we should have a working watch again. Try to get this off the cage. Like so, brilliant. You still have some shadows visible but it's much better than previously and the main thing you won't hurt yourself so it is possible just to resurrect your watch and i don't would say that it's now still waterproof of course because yeah we just applied it and i I just won't do this. I mean, rain possibly is fine, but swimming and stuff I would not recommend. But come on, I mean, for 20 bucks, I think it's a very good and efficient fix because just replacing the glass, that's nearly an impossible repair. I mean, you can look it up in, in some videos on YouTube, it's not worth it. And replacing the whole unit, so the whole display unit, that's also very, very difficult. So you are more likely just damaging your watch completely. So this is a really good way to use your watch. Don't mess up your fingers with injuries for the shattered glass. And you see here the watch just booted up. Touch is working fine as you can see. So that's all fine. Yeah, perfect. Okay, the watch may not look perfect after our treatment, but it definitely looks better than before. Most importantly, it is usable again and the cost for this repair is very low. What do you think? Is it worth it? Please let me know in the comments. If you like this little experiment, please give it a thumbs up. If you in general are interested in such repairs or mods, please consider subscribing to my channel. Have a heart for broken devices and give them a second chance. Stay healthy and until next time. Bye!